So, as promised, but a little bit late, we'll do a security review, shall we? So here's the door. This is that fiberglass sheeting that I had bolted it to the door, makes it a bit, a bit more secure. Obviously it has a standard lock and a standard padlock. So, uh, you know, if the crooks are gonna come and roll your break into your building, they've come prepared for that. But they haven't come prepared, hold on. They haven't come prepared for the Reggie lock, mm, for the Reggie door on the inside. Which, the more they give that grief, the worse it gets. Now here, the, the lock is shielded. It goes through this little hole here. The lock is shielded, so um, in theory, it's a bit harder to get to. So, uh, okay, they've made their way in. Oh, plus, I forgot to tell you, I forgot to show you. And it's, it's fun making and thinking about it. Part of the fun is just doing it. Here, we have a, a secret. Can we see that? Can we see? We have a secret mechanism. Mm, and there's a theme to that. So we have a secret mechanism. Reshutting the door. So, oh, let me just show you. Let me just... There it is locked. There's the, the thing turned. Here we are, we've unlocked it. It won't open, because we've got a secret mechanism in place. <laughs> hmm. So all it is, is a, you know, catching a catch bar here, and uh, a bolt through the wall. Just, it's fun making it, forget about security, but it's just nice to have. Now always, if you've got an internal door space, you know, one room going to the next, the thing is, you don't need a lock or a, something like that. But if you're working indoors, it's worth putting a simple, you know. So if they do, let's say, let's say they come into the building via this roof or via that wall, you just put another barrier in the way and it's not an aggravation to um, where's your keys, lock it all the time. Just use a hook, a simple hook. So if they're in there now, they've got to get in here, haven't they? So it's just another barrier. So if you've got internal doors or internal doorways, it's always worth, always worth having. Um, we shut, so I'll show you the other one. Anyway, let's... Um, these are the doors, these are the bars inside the door. Here's the up and over door. Here's my first body bar. And then here's my other, there's a top and a bottom bar. I go across, they sit on here. You remember Scoutcrafter was talking about um, telegraph pole foot, and then they bolt into here, which is supported the door. Um, at the same time, there's, I'll show you, I'll go around the other side, there's another bit to this film, but that, the door, the outside door, comes through the wall and it's screwed on this way. And whilst we're here, let's mention, <coughs> let's mention, <laughs> let's mention the special lever. Let's mention the Reggie special lever. You'll see how I've made this, it's basically a a scaffolding tube with a rod inside. Yeah, um, what are we? Is that's shut, that's open. We need to open that up now. So I'll go and make another film and you'll see the other end of that. Where were we? We were on the inside of this door, weren't we? See how this goes through the wall, which screws in. Um, we've got the appropriate signs in place. It's just another barrier in the way this goes through the wall you see and whilst you hold it sort of temporarily it's clipped in here now i did make a mechanism to come through the wall and clamp this hinge but there's way too much leverage on uh, on that so this wasn't a very successful job it didn't do the trick but it's it's fun inventing your own security systems isn't it See my secret lock, <laughs> the door, you can undo it. I've got a little secret slidey bolt. 
that just opens and shuts the door look on top of cctv and, and, and alarm systems and all the rest of it i just enjoy doing it alarm system cctv all over the place anyway um the same here it's a door but it's a slightly beefed up door um and you see the bar goes across it's a very simple system it's a very simple system you just have a plate a keep to put the bar in there and then you just come out through there screw it a couple of turns and you've got another door another bar behind your door well what i do again you'll see i like these hooks um, just just slows down because this is an internal door it slows them down again so shall we do this one? <laughs> oh, and i was telling you about here is the scaffolding tube coming through with a tube inside it and this clips the door you see when i throw the clip it throws it in there let's show you do you see it that connects into there so even if you break this door open you've still got to go next door to operate the homemade secret lever and then how do you make a chain the trouble with a chain is you you put a chain around something and you break the link and that's it you're through but what i've done here is i've welded a scaffolding tube drilled a hole welded a bolt in there this goes through the top here and this one with a bit of a cable tie goes underneath that so when they break one chain the bot is still and the lock is in here in this gap here so when they break through one chain say they break this chain there's still another chain holding it in here because the lock's there yeah so how do you make one chain twice as strong you put the lock in there that comes up through there the lock in there and lock that on top of your ordinary lock that you've got anyway uh, and you catch hmm where are we oh. sometimes a good idea to get rid of that because i bang my head on the damn thing and again protect the windows you know you've got a window it's a shed so they don't break through the glass they can um and they hardly think about it because when they look at it they say no point breaking that glass because there's security on the inside of it hmm so last one now last one we're nearly there we're nearly there uh, i gave you a hint on this one this one is a set of doors there's an up and over here up and over door there and then a reggie a reggie door here with a reggie lock um it's only you use what you've got but i happen to have i happen to have some gates so i turn the gate upwards turn the gate on its side stick a hinge on it uh made my own lock and the internal gates i open that way so it just gives them two gates to go through instead of one instead of breaking through a door it just puts them off you know what i mean it just puts them off makes it more difficult because your stuff is yours it's nobody else's um and again alarms and cctv and and everything else hmm. but it's fun it's fun just making it you see I had a flat bar i bent it round welded a bar across so i jointed here and then i welded a bolt on this side and i welded a bolt on the other side on this one see that's my opening weight my, my gate open weight so what happens see i'm trying to do this with one hand see one bolt they, they, they make like a crisscross and you put your and you put your lock between them and the lock can't pass it and they don't separate and voila you've got yourself a lock 
so you know we love our sheds and we love inventing stuff so this is reggie's security inventions <laughs>